Both of my parents grew up during the Great Depression, which although it was a time of enormous hardship for a lot of people, and my mother's family was very poor, it was an assumption, I think, without even being spoken of in our family, that if you had more than you needed, and someone needed some help, that you would help them. And so her uh, area of focus became education, especially in underserved communities, and it just kind of flowed naturally from who she is and, and her view of the world. Well, I think Dolly and I have become increasingly close. I've enjoyed very much to have her as a thought partner over the years I've been here at the Lummelson Foundation. She certainly taught me a lot about uh, humility, generosity, and how one is strategic in giving. She is so very genuine and humble in her giving that I think most people don't recognize the impact she's had on people's lives. She has touched people all the way from the individual level, changed the trajectory of their lives, to helping to ensure that there are solutions that will reach hundreds of millions of people. And I hope that this award will help highlight that for everyone. Over the years, the Lemelson Foundation, with my mom at its head, has supported a wide range of, of programs supporting inventors and entrepreneurs, and particularly young inventors and inventor education. Because Portland is the home of the foundation, we've made supporting programs in Oregon a big part of our focus. Inventor was actually the inspiration of the Lamelson Foundation. Invention is everywhere and it could be anybody, uh, but we really wanted to focus on collegiate invention and inventors. You know, these are where students are coming to find their life direction. With the gift of the Lamelson Foundation, Vent Oregon, they're helping change the landscape of Oregon for years to come. Mrs. Lemelson, thank you so much. I mean, you're, you're really removing barriers that keep people from pursuing new ideas, and you're giving them the confidence and the, the training to, uh, to go out there and invent things. So we, we really appreciate it. Thank you so much for helping out people like me, people who have an idea but don't necessarily have the resources or the experience to turn it from an idea into a reality. Yeah, I'd like to say to Dolly, I think, tonight as we recognize the Simon Benson Award uh, for her work is that she is an inspiration to others and I think in her own humble way she doesn't realize how much she inspires everyone who comes in contact with her to be a better person.